For the best in food and gaming, visit all three Golden Gaming properties. Desert Haven Animal Society just got the approval from the Board of County Commissioners to reopen the Pahrump Animal Shelter. We are very proud that they put our trust in us to do this and we want to make the best um, opportunity for the community to have a shelter open to the public and animals available as soon as we can. We do have quite a bit of work ahead of us, but we know everyone's anxious to see the opening. We're hoping it'll be within two weeks. Marla, you're going to be the shelter manager? Yes. All right. So, um, so are you guys going to the old shelter, or are you opening the new one? Or tell me about that. Indeed, we are. That was the agreement. The working relationship that we have with the county is that we would be able to use the existing facility, and then we would provide the services. Um, we do hope to build another facility. That is our, our desire, our plan, but it's going to take a few years. So right now we just have a lot of updating and renovating basically the old uh, old facility. So where's the funds coming from? What's happening with that? Our funds are coming mostly from personal donations. Uh, we also are, have some grants that we are applying for. We will be keeping obviously the adoption fees, any impound fees for animals that are picked up, running at large and returned to owner, and also licensing fees for rabies uh, licensing and registration and so um, there's some animals that are in there that are in protective custody um, will they be still at that facility and how much are are actually being held there right now actually uh, I think there is only one there now yeah. thankfully all of those animals that were in protective custody there was almost uh, a little over 40 have been uh, moved to another rescue and, and so this facility is a little dilapidated so it, there's going to be some upgrades that hopefully will be coming um, that direction soon yes we have a lot of volunteers that are willing to help us with that and um, donated materials and so forth but we do need more we have a wish list again on our Facebook page and at the website and that's under Desert Haven right correct and so if people want to make donations they can do that on the website absolutely and for more information, or is the shelter going to have the same phone number? Yes, the shelter will have the same phone number. Uh, we are not going to be answering that phone probably until April 1st. So the old phone number is 751-7020. And then they can go to the website, but if they have any questions, can they give a call? Do you have a number right now that they can call to? The best way to reach us is through the website and email, uh, deserthavenanimalsociety.org. Uh, the other thing we are telling people, if you do want to come down and see some of these animals, that we actually have here at the animal hospital. It's all Creatures Animal Hospital on Basin um, to come between one and two and we're, we'll be available to show animals and take applications.